Brob. Empiricism is a theory that all knowledge is based on experience only. Ah, uh, that's 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 debunked. Okay, thank you for saying what that is. Empiricism, that's completely debunked, right? All you need to do is look at animals that are born, other species, not humans, right? Look at look at a deer, a fawn, right? They most animals four legged animals anyway when they're born they know they they learn how to walk within minutes and how to run within minutes right that that's not experience that's just genetic survival right so is there's genetic information being passed along right uh, so many animals there's so many experiences how do animals know what to do right look at kitty cats like little kittens when when they're born they they go find the milk right they drink the milk and then they do kitty catty things <laughs> where'd they learn that stuff from i don't know it's genetics there's genetic information being passed along there's no doubt about it right is genetics passing along mathematical formulas no but there are certain people that are born with more innate abilities to do mathematics than others, right? Herbert Thorpe. Trump says a lot of things. How did arresting Hillary and the border wall go indeed? Well, he was, you got to give it to him. He was trying to build a border wall, right? But we'll see. Oh, look out. Will Trump be Z free in 2025? Bob, that's DNA. But what about consciousness? Uh, consciousness learned? Consciousness is consciousness. I'm not sure. Let me read your thing again. Empiricism is the theory that all knowledge is based on experience only. That I disagree with. That's DNA. But what about consciousness? Well, that's a good question. Consciousness. I believe that I am a conscious human being and I am more than just physical realm physical body that i occupy okay there are certain uh laws and rules associated with this physical body that limit my conscious interaction while i occupy this body right what happens when i no longer occupy this body i don't know i don't know i think we can get glimpses of it i think entheogens give us glimpses of it I think meditation might give us glimpses of it. I think maybe prayer can give us glimpses of it. But we can we cannot be 100% certain of what life. Life is just not this animated body, animal, animation, right? It's just not this animated body. My life is me, my consciousness, right? Elagos says genetics is knowledge. I was born an anarchist. <laughs> Buddy, I'm off to the uh, underverse when I die. Ha ha ha. Smoking cigars. Padre, padre, padre. Did Helen Keller have much going on before she was taught? Seems like there was something in there. She, uh, she just didn't have the tools to express it yeah the expressing part is different communicating is different right if you don't know you know if just if you you're just your i don't want to say your mind but if you're just imprisoned inside a shell and there is no form of communication what would life be then right i hope i never find out right i hope i never find out because part of life is the ability to communicate for me right uh, it would be chaos, insanity. All right. 